That's great. Let's go, baby. I got so many questions. Go ahead, though. But um, before me, before I got banned, I never heard the the concept or the idea or the conceptualization of someone saying, if I get banned, I'll just move to Rumble. Mm -hmm. I never heard anyone say that. And then after my ban, I've heard it about 50 times. True. Everyone's saying, oh, well, Tate, they banned Tate, and he's bigger than ever. So, so no one's afraid of being canceled anymore. Part of that is absolutely massive credit to Rumble on the platform and the CEO because they're visionaries. But also it's me showing the world that if, even if they come at you with the hardest cancellation method they came at me like they came at trump they came in with everything but i think i think with yours and in my opinion too because i'm i'm watching everything when i i mean there's always been problems and you know an issue with free speech on social media but i think your like your situation to me that was that was the game changer for me one of a kind that was like yeah yeah after that i was like all right yo they made a statement like now it's different anyone can be deleted like you we don't have free speech yeah. So I think, yeah, I think what happened to Tate was a complete, that was the shift. Yeah. I got to ask you, did you know, kind of along what you're talking about, Kyle, but did you know, like before you got into all this, that the clip thing was the, was the nature that was going to propel you? Like the TikTok, making the clips, like, because you didn't actually have social media. Like you weren't like on TikTok posting. It was on TikToks. the gram. He wasn't really on the gram. Like his content was like crazy explosive on the TikTok. The IG was just to you probably get IG, DMs from girls. But and were shit, you right? like aware that that TikTok was going to be that thing that was going to explode you to that level? Because because we just talked about now you're off of it, and that's what I'm saying. Your case is unique because you are a person that like even prior to like your your popularity on Instagram or those other platforms, you had popularity amassed from your audience that was like sharing your content. Mm -hmm. So that's unique. It's not like a regular person who got canceled and they're like. Well, now I'm going to go to Rumble. You already had visibility because I see you every time I open up TikTok just because people are using your content. So did, was that a part of your plan? Yeah.